Hello Earth Signs, this is Nick Nevin and I'm going to do a crystal ball reading for you for the full moon and the, the reason I'm doing it for this full moon is because it's a super full moon on November 14th and I read that um, it's, it's a very uh, dramatic full moon this year. It's in the sign of Taurus, so this is perfect for all of you earth signs this time. And it's a very special super moon because we haven't had one like this since 1948. So it's supposed to be even bigger and brighter than normal. So it's a very, very powerful time for everybody on November 14th, but also the two days leading up to the 14th and um, the two days after the 14th will also be very significant and very powerful time for everybody. So what I do though, to, to do a crystal ball reading, I like to get a little focus first uh, for, for the earth signs to see what area in life uh, you need, you will be focusing on and what this, this um, super moon is about. And what I do is I make up these charm keys, uh, key rings. And on the ring I put in um, charms that are symbols to me. And I pick out one charm of focus, uh, one charm to focus on. It gives me symbolism. And you know, I have the the key, which is unlocking, locking, and it's about wisdom. And I have an anchor, a little anchor there. And I have the heart. Well, the anchor represents we want what we uh, attach ourselves to, or what we want to be attached to, or where our grounding, grounding, excuse me, and centering is. Uh, I have the cross for s representing spirit or spiritual eyes. I have uh, a lock, so what we want to keep locked away or hidden. And uh, I have a, a key, a gemstone uh, ring, rather. I'm getting a little tired. I did a few readings. Um, <coughs> excuse me. But the, the key, um, sorry, the ring represents uh, how we are in the world, what, are commit, what we're committed to. And let's see, I said the key, the heart, that's it. That's all of them. So what I do is I just, you know, roll them around and I think about the earth signs. And I'm not looking at them, but I'm just you know, rolling them around and trying to just feel the energy and whichever one pops up is what I go with. Okay, I picked the skeleton key. So this super moon for earth signs, you're going to be either locking something away or opening something, opening up to knowledge. Um, knowledge or or keeping something hidden. But now I'll go to the crystal ball. So I have my focus as the key and I'll just use my pendulum. And with this crystal ball, he's mostly a power ball actually. It gives me energy and psychic powers and the spirit in this ball I call forth to come give me a, a reading. So I just focus on the pendulum and then I call him um, it's a male energy, a male spirit, and um, he helps me uh, give me messages. So I'm just calling him forth. Let me just focus. And spirit, please come through. If you're here, just circle to the right. Just give it a minute. Sometimes it takes them a little while to get warmed up. Let's put it to where you can see it. Okay. 
Okay. Just waiting for a little more power to make sure it's the spirit I wish for. Okay. All right. A little more power, please. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> I have to make sure it's the right spirit coming to speak with me. Okay. So now, uh, the bull just has to warm up a little bit. I have to feel the energy and you will see probably pictures, faces, landscapes. Um, don't worry about what you see. I'm getting the psychic messages here. It's not always about the picture, but the energy that I'm feeling from the spirit. So what do we have for November 14th, the super full moon for the earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay, okay, he's warming up. <laughs> okay. Searching here. All right. Wow. Okay. The the energy. What I'm seeing. What I'm seeing is. It's actually not seeing. I'm I'm hearing like a stampede, like a, a horse running or a stampede of horses running, like racing. Very powerful energy. Oh, and waterfalls, water, waterfalling, okay. Ah, uh, I've never, wow, I've never felt the earth signs so determined. I mean, all earth signs, all earth signs are very determined people, but this is like, I've never seen the focus and energy coming out for the earth signs like this. This is really a powerful, powerful time for the earth signs. They're unlocking, unlocking their creativity and emotional side in a, in a way that you've never been before in a way that you've never experienced before. Your focus, your energy, it's so powerful. Um, not only do you focus on you what you want in the world, you recognizing exactly yourself and who you have become there's a sense of the shadow dance here a sense of uh, you know playing in the shadows meaning meaning you are exploring your shadow self your dark side um, your your hidden emotions you really focusing on self and and exploring like never before exploring the self the inner self the your imagination your creativity uh, who you are who you've become who who you've been and and where you want to go in the world it, it's like a dance going on um, you know, I, I, I feel this stampede, you know, like this energy is like a stampede coming, you know. Uh, you know, I, I've really never felt such, you know, moving forward, moving ahead in leaps and bounds. You, you're, you're, it's like the chains broke on you. You've been gated, you've been held up for a long time and now the chain's breaking uh, this this hold this this uh entrapment feeling it, it's releasing on on 
probably on the 12th as uh, you start to feel the change happening, but on the 14th, oh, pow, on the 14th, doors open up, uh, opportunities open up, you're seeing uh, yourself in a whole new light. You're, you're no, it's like you are transforming, transforming and, and wanting, uh, wanting something totally different than, than you thought you ever wanted. Um, now you feel, now you feel like, you know, I got it all wrong. I, I was going for whatever, the money, the, the looks of things, the luxury, I thought that's what I, I wanted or needed and now I see that, that that has no meaning for me, that what I want now is, is my authentic self. I want my authentic self. I want to express myself so much. I want to uh, create things. I want to feel emotions. I want, uh, you know, I want love. I really, you know, this is like, I really want true love. I want true passion in life. And I'm going to get it now. I, I got it. I got the message. I got the, you know, I heard the message. It's, I'm waking up and I, I get it. I know where I went wrong. I know what I did and I can't do anything about the past. So now it's like you're, the transformation's begun. The firing has begun. You've You've, you're starting the work and the, you know, you're putting yourself in the crucible and you're, you're uh, you know, you are transforming yourself now. You don't want to be what you were before. You, you want to be, you know, the authentic self, not that you want to lose who you, you were, but you want to take the good parts of what you were. And, and rekindle those those things within yourself that you forgot and and pow it's like uh, what I you know it's like finding the book you've been looking for and now you found the knowledge and you're just running with it oh I found the information I need and and now I can be and do you know what I've always wanted to do but I, I never even knew I wanted this I never knew I had was lacking, you know. I, I was I was driven before, but I was driven to, for the wrong things. Um, and now I I want to focus on love in my life. I want to focus on expression. I want to focus on uh, emotions, and like never before, like never before. It is like a dance. Um, it's it's you know there's a sense of luck here too like timing the timing is right now it's finally right that's how it feels the timing is right and and you know there's there's a this creative urge coming through this wanting to produce and to to express like never before you know, wanting to tell loved ones how you feel about them, wanting to write, wanting to do photography, wanting to do art, you know, just wanting to have this real enchantment, you know, to feel this enchantment and to produce enchantment and to, and to finally feel free. There's a sense uh, uh, this reading is I'm feeling freedom and release from bondage, from chains of bondage that you perhaps put yourself in, into those chains. And, and now you're breaking free and, and just, like I said, you have, you have the, the knowledge now, the information, you know what's right, what's wrong, there's this sense of, you know, I got the picture, I'm going for it now. And, and you go for it and in a very profound, powerful way. You, there's nothing stopping you. There's nothing gonna stop you. The, you know, the building's collapsing, the, the foundation fell. Now you're gonna rebuild in a whole new way and 
and you're gonna react and you're gonna it's like you know realizing what life is about and and now you're determined to live it to the fullest you know no matter what cycle of life you're in if you're young middle-aged old it doesn't matter you you figured out what's important and and with this knowledge you just you just take off running and are driven and you know and nothing will get in your way so i hope you enjoyed this uh little reading and every all earth signs you really have a, a powerful full moon coming for you so use it enjoy it and have a great month of november everyone bye bye